Okay, it's Ian back at the dump. Hey guys, what's up? Well, here's what I got right here. This tree, right before we left last time, I went ahead and pushed it on over. Little piece of crap elm tree. And uh, so we're gonna get it out of the way. And then we're gonna get down that hole, clear it out a little bit, and see what we can find. I think across right, this is all dug underneath this right here, up to here. All the way up to there, as you can see, right along this ledge here. We're gonna come over here, probably on, just run on the inside of that tree there, and we're gonna run right across here. And hopefully, right in this area here, we're gonna run into Christie's Red Rake. That would be really nice. Get that one off my back. As you can see, we still got bottles and bottles and bottles and bottles to get out of here and do something with. So, anyways, but we're backfilled to this point and we're just making our way around it took us a little while to figure out how to do this but I think we know how to dig them now so I'll get back to you when I got something uncovered well as you can see I got the tree cut it's over there but I still got the root ball here and I'm chopping around the root ball and I got a little dirt cleared out here at my feet and I spot that poking out let's go ahead and pull that bad boy looks like a white mid See, let's see. Get it wiped off here. Get it wiped off. CW Lighter Perfume, New York. Oh, huh, that's cool. Just on the one, just on the one side. That's a good bottle. Christy gonna be happy about that one. All right, we'll get back to you if we find something else. Stump removal complete. So we got a hole over here. We can get on the back side of this thing now. No telling what's back here. That's broke. Little thing there. I see a bromo. One of those. That bromo here though. Actually it's not just a slick blue one. That's a good start. That's uh The Baker, Baker and Levi, or something there. So, all right, that's about all I can see. I'm sure there's a bunch more down there, but I have to get down there to it. So I'm about to move some dirt, get down there to it, and I'll get back with you. All right, it's getting dark, but I got a couple things here. Um, let's see, right here. I don't know if you guys can see the back end of that. Hoping it's full. It is. And it is a damn slick. I cannot believe that. This is something on the bottom. Hmm, huh, it does say something on the bottom. Weird. Anyways, I think I can't see it's getting too dark. Anyways, we'll probably take that one home. But uh, we got a stoneware pot right here. You might be able to see it. And I got a, I believe, oh my. It's a screw top. Old screw top. Salad dressing type. It's got a machine mark on the bottom, so. It's not a lot old, but I do have something right here that flopped out that I'm super excited about. Samuel Westingheimer, St. Joe, Missouri. Local whiskey flask. Absolutely pumped about that. Absolutely pumped, and it looks like... Let's see, let's get wiped off. And sons, it says. Wow. I'm floored. Look at that, guys. 
Westingheimer and Son, St. Joe, Missouri. Take care of that one on the way out. But I got a layer here. I'm probably going to dig for a few more minutes, but you guys know how much Christy likes digging, so I'm not going to steal all the fun, but I am going to dig here for about five more minutes, see if we get something else and get back to you.